Um, Want to talk to you also about obesity. <coughs> we yep. had uh, uh, Adam Rosenbluth here. And we talked about high blood pressure and obesity. And I think obesity also has a lot to do with some of the back pain because this spine, as you mentioned, it's not meant to carry all that weight. And by just that weight, it probably presses a lot on those vertebras and the muscles, right? Yes. Yeah, well, so if you're carrying more weight, and particularly if you're carrying more weight in the front and you're leaning forward, that's more weight that's loading your discs loading your nerves. Um, also, women with very large breasts, oftentimes the weight of that will cause back pain and thoracic pain, and they will get a breast reduction, and that actually helps the back pain. That's so mostly neck pain, right? Neck and thoracic. I see. So any weight that's in front and you're carrying puts more strain on the spine. And what a, another interesting fact is any weight that you're putting in front of you, the further it is in front of you, the more weight is transmitted to the spine by a factor of three because of the distance. So That's it's magnified. Here you hold a weight, there's almost no effort on the spine. You put that weight out here, it's an enormous magnification. So I think from what I hear is lose the weight, certainly exercise, mm -hmm. and that all that sedentary life, even if you have to get up for a few minutes and walk around, put the computer down and make sure like you walk around. This stretching is is also important.